New Year, same old Dolphins. I don't even have to finish the game. Five minutes-ish left. Yeah, blowing out by the Titans. That's pretty much what I expected. People wonder why I'm super pessimistic with choosing the Dolphins, you know, and picking the Dolphins at any point. Why I usually pick against the Dolphins, because again, you know, whenever they have any expectations, any whatsoever, they find some way to lose. And bad playoff hopes aren't really dead yet, um, but based on how the games were looking so far when time of this recording, there is no chance the Dolphins are going to get back into the playoff race. Unless, like, Baltimore loses, the Chargers lose, um, I think also the Browns have to lose, or the Browns got to win, I think? Something like that, I can't remember, but this is the exact reason why I pick against the Dolphins every game, every single week, because I know the Dolphins, I've watched them for the last 20 years, this is what they do, they give hope, they give promise, and then they fail, they absolutely fail, it's every year, it's to the point where there is no point in having hope, because they give up, they just give up, crash and burn, I'm just glad I wasn't able to see the game, because uh, once again, Florida decides when you have multiple Florida teams playing, the only team we get to watch is the Buccaneers, or any one of the two teams that are doing decent, I guess, I don't know, it's usually just the Buccaneers, or the Jags, like Miami's never shown anywhere, other than like just the tip of South Florida, but I'm glad I didn't get to see the game, because I would have probably been upset more than I am, you know, because, like, now, not getting to see the game I was expecting to lose, I'm kind of happy I didn't get to watch it, you know, but, yeah, fins down, because, again, they failed everyone's expectations, again, they gave us promise and failed that promise again, um, getting absolutely humbled, I guess, again, by a superior team that we should actually be able to be in the game with, but, you know, fuck it. I'm not mad at the Titans either, because I do like ti the Titans. I do, and I like Tannehill still. Just, once again, I wish the Dolphins would just one day get out of this rut, you know? Out of the same old, same old thing every single year. Uh, I don't even need to run statistics. It's, they only get like three points. And Titans, uh, uh, last time I checked, were on the move to get a fourth touchdown. So it's no point in the, even keeping track of the game. Titans, if they, they might as well just take out their starters. Oh my god. That's just bad. It's bad. Once again, the offense is absolutely useless. We all know the offense is crap. Offensive line sucks. No real running game, wide receivers, crap with no separations, yada, 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 coaching staff suck, all the, 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 all the talking points. You can spout, spout all of them, even say two is the problem, but it's going to be the same thing every year. It doesn't matter if we have a new quarterback or not, we see the same thing over and over again. So, the title of the video is like, it, it's just going to be New Year, same old Dolphins. I think I've already done a video of it once, but, you know, might as well do it again. Not mad. Not really disappointed. Just figures. Just really, really figures. Again.